that Satan should get an advantage of us, for we're not ignorant of his devices. Call Loyam La Yah Bashmi Awashar Bashem Kakwadash, double honest to the elder apostles of the great millstone who were well, peace and salutations to the tabernacle of David, though for elect. Now, just about a week ago, you had this uh this shape shifting reptilian Amalekite, the CEO of Pfizer, uh Albert Borla, in which uh, he was promoting you know his uh, latest uh product in which they was coming with a new alternative as you all know that they're trying to come out with a, a pill and uh, that's for people that's you know that's hesitant to, to to get the the needle version so they're coming up with a pill and they're saying that this is going to be you know effective it has an 89 percent effective rate um you know he was promoting like hey this this is going to be the game changer right here and they're trying to get it uh approved by the fda which more than likely they more than likely will because they all are in cahoots they all together but uh this was uh at a world economic forum a few years ago this was back in like 2018 now listen to what he actually says when they asked him to break down this particular product, find out what's actually in this pill. And this is out of the CEO's mouth. Um, I have a question about patient engagement, and you had touched on this before. Um, all of these advances are amazing, but even if you make the greatest drug or the greatest wearable, there's no guarantee that the patient is going to take the drug <clears throat> wear the device. So how are you thinking about technology to engage the patient? Yeah. Again, maybe I will use an example. I think uh, it's fascinating what's happening in this field right now. I mean, FDA approved the first uh, electronic pill, if I can call it like that. So it is a basically biological chip that it is in the tablet. And once you take the tablet, and dissolves into your stomach, sends a signal that you took the tablet. So imagine the applications of that, the compliance, uh, the insurance companies to know that the medicines that patients should take, they do take them. Uh, it is uh, fascinating what happens in, in uh, this field. But of course, there will yep. be an initial cost that someone needs to invest. That part. So that's not what they're actually telling you. Well, they're promoting how this is going to be a game changer. This is going to be, you know, the next tool in the toolbox, so to speak. But they ain't saying, they ain't saying that, though. You got to go and dig for this. This is why I like these other alternative uh, platforms like, you know, BitChute and Odyssey. Because they're going back and they're digging and finding, you know, all these different, uh, 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 you know, speeches and statements. That all these de all these devils that are, you know, responsible for this whole thing, and that's you know helping to push it forward. They're finding all this shit, man. And they can't say that you know. These things weren't weren't said. It's it's all on film. All right. Let me get our Psalms. Sixty four and eight. And it says, so shall they make their own tongue to fall upon themselves. And you just, you know, just give it away. You know, because really you'd be excited and you, you know, you, 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 you give them, you know, the, 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 the game, so to speak, on what you got going and what you got planned out. And don't realize when you roll these things out <laughs> that you've already been uh, found out, man. Now we see what you coming with so this guy saying that they want to have a chip inside the damn pill <laughs> he said that it says so shall they make their own tongue to fall upon themselves all that see them shall flee away now let me get the one in uh, job actually uh, it was a job 15 Uh, Job 15, 
and six it says thine own mouth condemneth thee and not i yet thine own lips testify against thee all right now we see what you up to man we're not ignorant of your devices man all right, you're going to continue to get found out. Let's get uh, Psalms 10 and 15. And it says, Break thou the arm of the wicked and the evil man. Seek out his wickedness till thou find none. You're going to keep getting uh, searched out, man. That's why you have no choice but to just go hard. Keep pushing your agenda. I right, keep pushing for uh, you know, these people to 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 continue to get zombified, so you can continue to capitalize off of their misery, off of their blindness. But you know, pretty soon you're gonna end up meeting <laughs> the king of terrors, man. All right, then you can. You know, try to magnify yourself in his presence and see what happens. Uh, Psalms 140 and 8. It says, Grant not, O Yahweh, the desires of the wicked, further not his wicked device, lest they exalt themselves. Salah. You know, because these devils, they, you know, they boast, you know, of their uh, heart's desires. And, you know, their 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 hearts is uh is evil, man. This is all part of, you know, their secret councils, secret councils of, of the wicked. So he pretty much told you what it is. Okay, this new, this new alternative is supposed to be a game changer right here. All right, he's already confident that they're going to prove it. So be on the lookout for that. So. Now, I just want to uh, do that real quick. You know, this wasn't going to be a, a long lesson. I just want to put that out there. And a uh, matter of fact, I'll leave uh, I'll leave the link to this in the description box. All right, so with that, shalom.